working with him over all this time, I feel more confident in my ability to take care of myself. I'm more motivated to take care of myself. The biggest thing for me has been my kids being so happy and they're like, mom, you're doing such a good job and it really helps us when you do this, mom. And don't quit, mom, you're doing so well. Um, that is priceless to me. That's just priceless. I recommend this for anyone who is like stuck and you want to get better, that you know that you're not reaching your full potential, just feeling like crap, you're not using your gifts, okay? So you take care of you, let him help you take care of you, and then you can then you can share your love with others. Oh yeah, well I've done the gym thing, slammed around on my own, not really knowing what I was doing. I always just figured I was wasting my time, so it didn't really seem to help, because I didn't really know what to do. And like you had uh, explained to me too, like once you hit a certain age, things are different. You have to work out differently. You have to eat differently. It's not like I'm 20 anymore where I can just do whatever I want. Drink a gallon of milk and be totally fine, you know, that kind of thing. Uh, so I just didn't really know what I was supposed to be doing. I had a base knowledge from being in the military exercise, but that's when I was 20, you know, doing 100 push-ups, you know, 500 sit-ups. That thing just wasn't going to work for me anymore. Uh, so I just needed some guidance, I guess you could say. And uh, some someone to tell me, hey, this is what you're supposed to be eating at this age, and these are the things you should stay away from that kind of thing. Um, I would recommend Mark's program for someone who is ready to make a change and who knows um, that they're going, that it's not going to be easy. Because um, frankly, good things just don't come easily. Um, and there are going to be some, you know, some sacrifices like less ice cream, less cake. Sorry. My, my personal least favorite thing is less pizza. That's no fun. Um, also less alcohol so you know it's you do have to cut out certain things well not cut them out but at least reduce them um, but in return you know you'll build fitness you'll gain self-confidence you'll feel better you'll sleep better um, you'll probably be happier um, because believe it or not exercise does make you happy um, and you'll see results that you will love and um, I think it's all done in a really great sustainable way so give it a shot. Mark just really makes you change the way you think about food and what we use food for and it's for fuel and not just to go binge eat whenever you want to and he also reminds us that um, if you have one mess up it doesn't ruin your whole day or your whole week which uh, took me a little while to get that I used to think that if I just had a bad meal then forget the rest of the day or forget the rest of the week and I'll restart next week. I was in a place of um, wanting to feel like my old self again and uh, wanted to be in this it wanted wanting to be comfortable in the skin I was in um, not wanting to miss out on the things that I love to do with my family like uh, wake surfing and wakeboarding and being out on the lake um, in my bathing suit and I just didn't want to uh, watch my life uh, go by sitting um, sitting out. I wanted to be a part of all of it again and wanted to feel confident doing it again. Uh, I've been with Mark since June of 2018 so I was five months postpartum. I have two boys um, and I'm wearing my, my glasses during this video because I wanted to look smart because I wanted to tell you about the smartest decision I ever made was going with him and just going all in and using, you know, trusting my gut to go with him and um, it has been the best decision I've ever made. Um, I needed the accountability the most um, and he provides that. And not only did I get a nutrition coach out of Mark, but I got uh, a Christian brother and just um, a, a life coach who uh, teaches me through certain situations with such grace. And um, I can proudly say that uh, since June, this is August, uh, Sept September, um, since June, I am down almost 15 pounds and uh, roughly maybe around 12, down 12 inches. And just feeling good, um, running around my two boys with so much energy, chasing after them, um, 
participating in wake surfing with my four-year-old, uh, and I've never felt better. Even though I had lost 173 pounds, my body just didn't change. It looked lumpy, and it looked just ridiculously out of shape. <laughs> it w my shape was round, so I decided it was time to start doing something. I get a little emotional because I've come so far, so fast. So in, in just seven weeks on this program, I have been able to lose 12 pounds and I have lost four inches off my waist. Yeah, I'm happy. I'm crying. Um, and I've lost four inches, I said, off my waist. And I've lost 22 and three quarter inches off my entire body. I'm actually wearing skinny jeans now. Me, skinny jeans. <laughs> That's amazing. I'm just so happy. It just makes me feel so good. And it's life changing. It's, I didn't think this could be a lifestyle. I didn't believe I could do it at all. And here I am crushing it. I just, I just am crushing it. And I'm so grateful. I'm so grateful to Mark Avens. And I'm just so grateful to God that he sent him to me. And I just know that now that my blood pressure has become a lot better, um, they have reduced my blood pressure medicine by half. I'm sleeping so much better than I ever have. I wake up feeling energized, and I'm actually excited that I get to exercise today. You know, it's just, it's an amazing feeling to change my whole life. All in just seven weeks, and now I just can't wait for the rest of my weeks of my life. I realize that this can be a lifestyle. That being actually healthy and fit was something that I was meant to do with my body. And I'm just so grateful to God for calling me to it. Trying to figure out what you're going to do to work out. I'm, I'm 18 minutes all in for the workout with stretching, cool down. Um, you know, I, I'm, I'm sweating. My shirt's wet. Um, it's a full intense workout if you're doing it the right way. Yeah, you're not wasting time, right? No, you're I not mean, wasting time. You're not, you know, dragging yourself out to the car, driving to the gym. Um, you know, I just, I, I set it up, you know, in my living room. Um, you know, I'm, I'm good to go. There's no distractions, not waiting on other people to finish on a machine. Then uh, my doctor has commented that the the ex I, I had a little problem I, you know with some anxiety things and causing my blood pressure to go up and even my doctor told me she said this exercise thing you're doing is probably saving your life keep it up and of course that really encouraged me to it is vitally important regardless of what age you are and i was skeptical about what you can do you know since COVID has identified me as elderly over and over and over again <laughs> What can I really gain or do? But I'm, I'm really, really, really feeling, I'm feeling good about myself now. And that, that means a great deal, that I feel stronger and, and healthier. What you do to yourself, I did not really start working out a great deal until in my 40s. And that's when I got my healthiest and got, got stronger. And I really think as you're aging, start now, don't wait start now and and I, I think your program especially since this virus and all the things that are keeping us home and you've proven that you didn't have to have a lot of equipment you didn't have to have a lot of stuff you didn't have to look cute to go to the gym with all the attire on but you just you just have to do it and you've made that if you can't do it in the comfort of your own home with nobody watching you know that you should be able to so I would just tell anybody out there start now don't don't think because i'm 50 60 70 35 whatever and i've never exercised do it because you will appreciate it as you age you, you really will and you're going to want to play i have soon to be between grandchildren and great grandchildren number 32 on the way and i intend to dance at most of their weddings so you know so awesome. <laughs> that's so great